As we enjoy our breakfast in the morning, we may be thinking about how these diets affect our health by causing obesity, diabetes, and heart diseases. Yet how many of us have ever realized that the food in front of us is also polluting the environment? In fact, our diets contribute significantly to greenhouse gas emissions, water consumption, and water pollution. These effects are becoming critical in developing countries, as people there are now consuming more animal products, such as meat, milk, and eggs. For instance, in China, the meat consumption has quadrupled just in the past four decades. As the first case on a developing country, my research evaluate the nutritional quality as well as the environmental impact of the Chinese diets. I look at the data from Chinese Health and Nutrition Survey to see what people have been eating in the past two decades and evaluate the quality of their diets with the Chinese Dietary Quality Index. I found that people ate fewer cereals, but more pork, beef, poultry, and eggs. However, such shift does not lead to healthier diets. At the same time, I quantify the greenhouse gas emissions, water consumption, and water pollution from these dietary patterns by multiplying the environmental impact per gram of food with the intake amount of each person. It turns out that the increased animal product consumption has led to a climbing environmental impact. Then, is it possible for us to develop a dietary pattern that is healthier both for our planet and ourselves? Unfortunately, the answer is no in this case. As Chinese consumers immediately shift to a healthier diet of vegetables, fish, and milk, there will be even larger environmental impact. So eating healthier does not necessarily benefit our environment then maybe we need to revise our goal. Instead of thinking about a win-win solution that can both benefit the environment and ourselves, the question we should be asking is, what is the minimal environmental impact for ensuring healthy lives? More research is needed to find the dietary patterns that can achieve this goal. So next time, when you are sitting at the dining table, just take a minute to think of those dual effects behind your dishes.